That's right. We're on live. We're going to get this thing done one way or another. What's up to y'all? Changes that you all have to make in order to date as a visually impaired or um, couple. I mean, like, if they were, tell us about them. <clears throat> you know, like special arrangements and whatnot in terms of maybe traveling or maybe this and that. Just share with us uh, a couple of them. You follow me? Yeah, I think definitely when it comes to our dates, we definitely, you know, we do love being spontaneous. Sometimes, you know, uh, we would go on random walks or explore, you know, random areas when we were both in the San Francisco area. Um, I think one of the things that we definitely have to take into consideration is our time. So even though we are being spontaneous, at least have a little bit of a plan, um, since we are taking public transportation, um, sometimes, you know, it, even if you're in big cities and public transportation is consistent or constant, um, you know, they could still be delayed. So, you know, we have to have plan A and plan B. Um, mm -hmm. And just, you know, that way we can at least know um, how much time we have to, you know, get back home or how much time we have to get to a restaurant or whatever activity we're doing for that day. So, you know, like I said, spontaneous is fun, but, you know, still having some type of a plan in place. Mm -hmm. okay. And also, Very like, nice. for, for in terms of activities to do um mm. usually it'd be fun to do things that are a little more hands-on like for example i could go to an art gallery and look at all the pictures but i don't know where jesh would want to go because i'm kind of with you <laughs> well, well we've been to a few art galleries and that if they don't have audio description that is the one describing it to me yeah, <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay or so then okay. like opposed to that then we would go to a museum to compensate it there would be like more hands-on activities that we could like touch and you know yep. touch things yep. and experience them on a more hands-on sort of way so that's something to consider too